Hey guys, it's Skies. This is some Dark Souls PvP, and this is with my quality build and my, I think, intelligence slash faith build. So this is just some matches I had in the forest. Uh, these are all just random stuff. There's really no point to this video uh, other than just uploading a video and talking to you guys about situations in life as well as some other things. But I hope you guys enjoy it. I uh, finally have all my stuff together so I can start editing videos again, and I'm ready for 100,000 more videos. So let's get ready and hope you guys enjoy it. Black. What's going on guys? Let's get into that PvP now. Uh, this is just again guys random invasions. There's really nothing uh, specific about this video. There's really no topic that I'm going to be uh, touching on. Uh, again, it's just a ramble uh, and just glad I'm recording again uh, so yeah guys there's really I hope you guys don't mind that when I talk I, I really don't have subjects to talk about I kind of just put on the mic throw on the headphones and just watch the footage all over again and just talk over it uh, right here as you can see I jumped down into the dark root basin and I finished this uh, ganker off because I didn't feel like dealing with them up there and then I uh, began to taunt but anyways guys let's jump into the commentary now even though I've already said that because I'm so awesome. <laughs> this clip right here, guys, uh, this is actually, I, I, I'm so glad I got this to record because it's, it's so perfect. I mean, this guy, I mean, this guy must feel like Master Chief from Halo 4. I mean, this shot right here is just amazing. So basically, these guys are ganking, and I'm like, you know what? Let me go recoup myself. I got to go back and breathe for a second. Let me go uh, switch up some stuff so I look like I'm actually doing something, but really I have no idea what I'm doing. So I think I put on the Darkwood Brain Ring, and watch this. This guy shoots me in the only area that you can get knocked off on in the bridge. I mean, I don't know if that's the only area, but still, it's an amazing shot. Kudos to you, sir. I don't know how you did that. You must feel like MLG Sniper. I mean, I'm pretty sure your hashtag for the day was MLG Sniper. 420, blaze it. But anyways, that was, uh, that was a great shot. Now we're just going to get into some regular PvP with the tryhard weapons and the, uh, the uh, go all out methods that's kind of how i go in pvp when i invade guys i invade i don't i don't really uh hold myself back i don't reserve myself uh for a sense of honor when i invade in the forest i mean really all i do is i just go in and uh if you're ganking you're ganking if you're not ganking you're still gonna get the same uh me as if you weren't if you were ganking so i just go all out and I don't really bow unless, you know, I know the person specifically, you know, like another uploader or maybe, you know, someone that I've dueled many times. But other than that, I just go all out. And, uh, and yeah, I've really been just watching a lot of the other uploaders' videos, you know, Jay Blackmail, uh, you know, him, Peeve, uh, Brandon. I've watched all their perspectives on the Dark Souls 2, and I'm really crossing my fingers so that way I hopefully get a network test pa uh, code so that way I could give you guys my perspective on Dark Souls 2. I don't know if you guys would want to see that, but that would I, I think that'd be hella dope for me. So I, I hope you guys wouldn't mind seeing that if I get into the network test. Uh, as far as uh, copyright and all that stuff, hopefully uh, Namco doesn't mind. I'm pretty sure that they do mind. I, I've, I've seen a lot of mixed uh, feelings for uploading Dark Souls 2 footage, but I'm going to upload it, give my shot, uh, get, hopefully get a shot at it, and give you guys my perspective. If not that, then maybe make a whole video of just regular PvP, but explain my perspective in the Dark Souls uh, 2 network test. So I can give you guys my perspective and show you if it feels clunky, uh, weapons, how they feel, and really get as much info, info as I can from that network test. So I hope you guys, guys don't mind that. Uh, also, on another note that made me chuckle earlier when I was watching, uh, I think it was Jay, one of Jay Blackmail's uh, videos, when he was talking about mechanics and meta and uh just a bunch of words that i'm uh i'm familiar with but i don't know nothing about i just want you guys to know this as my subscriber uh i don't know what i'm talking about half the time uh i mean realistically the only reason why i know half the things i know is because of watching other people's videos but i don't really know what a meta is i don't know what the what uh what mechanics really mean in a game i mean i could talk about animations for days because you know everyone loves an animation but you know as far as really talking about you know a game's breakdown how it feels blah blah blah. i don't know how it feels i kind of just look at it as a fun perspective you know hey i like this you know just uh let's just use this example long sword swung pretty good 
you know, in the Dark Souls 2 network test. It felt great for me. So I don't, I don't really use those words. You're not going to hear me say anything about mechanics. You're not going to hear me say anything about, uh, you know, meta or any of that stuff. You know, not that those are big words, but you know what I mean? I, I don't, I'm not really savvy with the, you know, I don't know how to say it. I don't, I, I want to say technological side of the game, but I guess that would sound stupid. But, you know, I'm not really savvy with that stuff. I don't really have, you know, I don't know the words for it. Anyways, that's me rambling, just kind of, just, just telling you guys that when, you, when you're when you getting a perspective from me, it's kind of like that fun-loving game guy, you know, it's, it's really, there's really no, uh, you know, oh, I know this, and the, the mechanics, and blah, 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 and C equals MC squared, and all that, I'm, I'm just in it for the fun, guys, so hopefully you guys don't mind that fun perspective of Dark Souls 2, and again, guys, the reason why I play Dark Souls, and I'm not bashing on the lore, or the or the you know the pve guys i just kind of uh again guys i play I, the reason what's kept me attached to dark souls is the pvp again the story is perfect i mean I, I love this game beyond anything with pve but it's not why i play this game i can't wake up every morning and say hey i'm gonna go beat the game all over again or hey i'm gonna do an orlando 10 times just because i love an orlando it's just I, that, that's not why i play the game i play the game strictly for pvp uh when i get online and if I'm, you know, if I'm really, you know, burnt out from, you know, PvPing, I do jump on PvE and maybe, you know, make a new build or something or, you know, and, you know, all my builds are created from scratch. The only time I ever create builds that aren't, you know, or use builds that aren't created from scratch is if I use the mule. But other than that, the mule is just the purpose of, so I don't have to go around all of Lordran looking for that weapon. I get the weapon from a mule and then I beat the game normally. I don't really uh, jump to the end of the, uh, you know. I usually get to a new game plus by myself with no help. So anyways, hope you guys are having a good day. Uh, I had a blast uh, in the forest. It, the, I feel like PvP kind of picked up a little bit with the Dark Souls 2 beta, but lately, uh, these past few days, I mean, it's been really dry. I mean, I don't know why uh, the, the game just really, uh, it doesn't have the, the community like I did six months ago. You know, I've been playing this game for... I don't know, almost close to a year now. Uh, I think a year. I think in December, or January, it'll be a year. I jumped into this game pretty late, but it, it's definitely changed so much. I mean, when I talk about a game that changes, this game changes. I've played Halo 4 competitively. I've played Gears of War competitively. I've played millions of games. I mean, not millions, but you get the picture. I've played a bunch of games, and they're all they all kind of stay the same in some way, shape, or form. But Dark Souls 2, the meta changes. You look at that. I use the word meta. That everything changes in the game like people you start using different things some things are more accepted than other things you know it changes a lot you know new glitches are found to you know improve or improve or disapprove uh pvp you know and it's just it's just crazy like move swapping and ring swapping and you know all that stuff just i don't know guys it's just i, I love dark souls it really is a good game i i love how it just keeps on changing i mean really we find something new about this game every other month or week you know and Ah, I just love this game, guys. That's really all I want to talk about. And I really touched up on everything that I want to talk about in the video. There's really nothing else that I want to talk about. I just love Dark Souls. Can't wait to keep uploading this game. Can't wait for the Dark Souls 2. And hopefully I get into the beta. But anyway, guys, I'm going to stop talking, rambling here. I'm going to say goodbye to you guys in a big fake face cam like I used to. And I shall see you guys in that video. Or that little skit that's going to pop up soon. So, see you guys then. And... That's it. That's it for this commentary. Hope you enjoyed it, and have yourself a swell day. And hopefully you're excited for more PvP. Goodbye. Alright dudes, don't forget to click on Derb. Derb's that little cloud with the beard, and when you click him, you could start suggesting more games for me to play. And that's it for this video. Thank you guys again, and I'm glad to be uploading again. I hope you guys are excited for the future, because I am. Alright.